No, but we got rice, beans, vegetables, uh, corn, pasta are the cheapest foods in the supermarket and they don't cause disease. And we're feeding children processed meats from gas-chambered pigs. If children knew what they were eating, oh my God, they'd have nightmares. But, you know, these are known carcinogens. They cause heart disease, the number one killer of human beings. Why not put labelling on them? But you are you are here, Joey. I mean, with respect, you're making some of this stuff up, aren't you? I mean, no. if you look at... I mean, you, you mentioned about animals being stabbed in the neck. What sort of slaughterhouse have you been to? Every single animal gets stabbed in the throat. Chickens, they have their pigs, throat cut. They get shot in the head and stabbed in the throat. They the get their gets... throat cut. Their throat is cut, isn't it? It's not well, stabbed well, in the well, throat. It's not a serial well, killer there well, pigs are standing stabbed. there with a meat cleaver. Yeah, their throat the is cut. But what I'm saying well, well, is you're, well, impl- well, you're well, employing hyperbole here to make your case because you don't want people to be eating meat. Well, and I can show most you hours eat- of animals being stabbed in the throat. And hours. I'm sure you could take the worst practice, and I could probably show you the best practice where that doesn't happen, where government vets are on site and you have a complete clean and humane show approach me. to... To, to slaughtering animals. And most people don't have carcinogenic issues. Most people don't have diseases because meat, e- meat eating is mostly safe. If you have an imbalanced diet, if you're not eating the right things alongside it, you might get a bunch of tumours and cancer and your heart goes ping at some point in your life. But for most people, that isn't going to happen. Most like- people live a healthy life, eat meat all their life, love every bit of it. Nothing goes Some wrong. Some people smoke cigarettes till they're 90. You know, and some people can smoke a bit of a the few cigarettes here and there. The average person doesn't die through eating meat, Joey. That you know cigarette that. Cigarette smoking doesn't cause lung cancer, and just because some people can eat meat uh, their whole life doesn't mean eat, eating meat doesn't cause heart disease. If you eat the wrong meat, the if you eat too much meat, clear. it's so you're balanced, going, isn't you're it? going up against the whole scientific community here when you say eating saturated fat and cholesterol so the whole doesn't of the cause. Sci- doesn't nobody, cause heart disease. Nobody said and it doesn't also, if you eat too much of it or the wrong meat products. I want to see this slaughterhouse where animals aren't getting a knife in their throat. Where's this magical slaughterhouse? So a house? knife is used, yes, in the slaughter process. It's called slaughtering animals. I don't know any Pigs other way to do gas it. Would you rather they used a hammer? What, 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 where, how else are you meant to dispatch an animal that's in a slaughterhouse? Well, how are you supposed to do it humanely? Because you stun the animal first. Uh, the animal so is stunned first. So stunning a human being is okay if it's done humanely? We're not talking about human beings. We're talking about the food well, chain. The We're talking difference? about pigs and cows. What's the, di- what's the difference between stunning someone in the head and slashing their throat open and stunning a cow in the head and slashing their throat open morally? So you make no differential between taking the life of a human and taking the life of an animal. Well, you can't pigs, seriously pigs believe have that. The, pigs have the intelligence of a three-year-old child. Now, what is the moral difference between a pig and a three-year-old child. So you would argue that there is no difference between taking the well, life I'm of a human you and an is. animal. Well, ta- you, you raised the point that <clears throat> there's an ethical issue here, and I'm simply countering it back, that in fact there is a moral difference between us and animals. Well, what, the is, it? what is it? So you wouldn't support, you wouldn't well, support the idea well, that people can look for a... Well, you're saying there's a moral difference between a, a three-year-old more, and a pig, and what is it? Tell you me. want me to articulate why we are more me. important in the food chain than a pig? I want you to tell me what the moral difference is between a three-year-old and a pig. Because we have a food chain, because we have a pecking order, because we have a diet, because it, we have, wait a the, a we have the ability... Chain, does a food like, chain mean moral? Does a food chain mean ethical? Well, what, are you, why are you the barometer of morality? I'm asking you what the moral difference is between a pig and a three-year-old and you can't answer but it. But I'm asking you why you believe you can set that moral compass where you want it to set. Why, why I can set a moral compass we have is because a you chain. adhere we, to your own moral system. But we are building... So, so you adhere to a moral system where you don't think human beings should be stabbed, but you don't adhere to that same moral system. You have a double standard for pigs. Now, I'm asking yes, you... Yes, because I moral... don't happen to think that I a pig... Asked, I answered your question. What's the moral difference between a pig with the intelligence of a three-year-old and a child that's three years old? What's the moral difference? What is the greatest contribution to the planet Earth of a pig? You answered a question well, no, I'm with asking, a question. I'm asking you the question. You answer, you answer what, is, what is a pig's greatest contribution? To what the, is a mentally a the, person with mental disabilities' contribution to the world? Doesn't mean they don't have moral value. We shouldn't treat people based on their intelligence. We shouldn't treat people immorally based on their intelligence. We shouldn't pe- treat a uh, pe- uh, tr- okay. so excuse me. We shouldn't treat pigs immorally based on their intelligence that's, level. That's fine, and that is your view. But you have to understand, not everybody follows Joey Carbstrong's worldview. Well, you have a moral system uh, for human beings that you adhere to, and we have a double standard for animals, and there's no moral well, difference. It's a different, diff- it's a different moral system, perhaps. Well, there's a double standard. I it's don't think hypocrisy. you guys are going to agree on that particular point. 